एवरीवन वेलकम वी आर गोइंग टू बी डिस्कसिंग द रिक्रूटिंग प्रोसेस ऑफ इन्फिटिक्यू इन्फोसिस सो वील कवर एवरीथिंग दैट यू नीड टू प्रिपेयर टू स्टडी फॉर द एग्जाम बिफोर दैट आई विल आल्सो टेल यू अकॉर्डिंग एन every year we see this from the last 2 3 years infosys has been conducting infitq now the reason why they are conducting infitq so generally if you see your placements are basically in your last year so for btech uh it would be in your 7th and 8th semester right but what happens is uh because higher package companies will come first like cisco amazon paypal flipkart all of those companies paying more than 20 lps so this is a norm that is set by uh these your college tpos or placement officers uh which is why you know uh, generally all of these service based companies do not get good people because they are already placed so there's a smart thing that has been done by infosys they've launched this thing called as infitq wherein they try to capture students in their 6th uh or uh, basically 5th or 6th semester so that and and the package that also we are going to be discussing would be 3.6 lpa there is 5 lpa and then there is 8 lpa so there's a the package at least these two packages are good enough so you'll get a pre placement offer plus internship with a very high package even before your placements beginning and since it's an off campus drive so your college cannot tell you not to apply for it and in in fact they'll promote you to apply for it so let's go ahead and understand the recruitment process before going ahead uh, you know many of you may not know about prep and stuff we are the largest and the most visited website for your placement preparation you're going to hear us about a lot and we specifically focus upon the final year graduate basically we specifically focus upon the people who are going to get jobs so <clears throat> let me just go ahead and first explain you what is infitq certification right so basically they are giving you a certification and a job both of them so there's an exam uh, first of all the benefits are that you get a certi- you get certified from infosys that okay he is a good programmer you get full time offer from infosys for, and the roles that they are offering are system engineer which is 3.6 lpa then power programmer specialist programmer which is 5 lpa and digital specialist engineer which is 8 lpa and eligible batches right now are 2023 right now this is kind of like a certification would look but they'll also certify you and give you a job let's say if you don't want a job just use the certificate to probably up your profile now there's one more thing uh, make sure that you follow prep and star on all of these social media platforms and i'll tell you why just a moment just give me so all of these five social media platforms may the link of all of those are given in the description of the video make sure that you follow us on instagram discord if you don't have an account on discord follow us on discord whatsapp and telegram at least these four mandatorily follow links are given in the description of the video the reason why and uh, so there's this we have different instagram for different batches so right now 2023 batch it would be this instagram but i just like to show you 2022 batch so as you can see we are regularly we have approximately 1 lakh followers so we are posting so cisco was hiring morgan stanley tata alexi uh, amazon code vita mindtree walmart uh wipro interview preparation tcs topers test about different results that is happening phone pay hiring twitter hiring so your college will not tell you so your college will only tell you that okay the companies that are visiting them or the companies that they are partnered with but uh you know a particular company like amazon cannot visit 3000 colleges every year so they have an off campus drive your college does not get to know about them because we are partnered with all of these companies so they directly uh you know speak to us and then we tell you all of those right and then you know you'll get to know uh, basically if you join other uh, telegram instagram and uh, uh, all of these links that i showed you so make sure that you follow us on our instagram discord uh, telegram whatsapp and uh, this call right so let's go ahead now before very quickly we'll focus upon this a little later but the course is already available on prep and star and prime so on prep and star you'll be able to find all the previous year questions that have been asked so let's say if you go to java here introduction to programming if you click here you'll come to this page there's a free material there's a paid material you can go ahead and check the free material and then uh, here if you if you let's say click upon start and then i've opened it already so that the page load does not take time so you can find all of these previous year questions so uh, because you may not know uh, 
all of these things which is what i'm telling you already right now we've already launched prep insta prime so in that prime you get access to all the 100 plus courses offered by prep insta so uh, you can read more about that link is in the description of the video but then infitq course is also there the courses including coding python java dbms data structures and comparative coding and even in comparative coding we are covering everything in advance so you'll get access to all the courses that are there for your placement preparation uh, we are partnered with tcs for remote internship certification ai cyber security ethical hacking cc plus plus java quants cocube zamcat infitq tcs in tcs nqt ninja cognizant microsoft goldman uh, projects, computer science subjects, etc, etc, right? So let's go ahead and understand. So this is the eligibility. I'll not talk about it. You can pause it and let's go, right? So how do, how do you get a job basically in Infosys via InfiTQ? So first of all, you need to register. I guess registration is starting on 26th, right? And uh, first of all, there's a certification round. Now, uh, we'll talk about the uh, number of questions and the topics a little later, but I want to explain you the whole, you know, how the recruitment process is like. Uh, so there's a certification round which would have Python, Java and a little bit of coding. If you score more than 65%, right? Now you have two options. Okay. Uh, first of all, if you score more than 65 percentile, you will definitely be getting an interview for six system engineer right here as you can see and if you don't clear the interview you are rejected you cannot but you can apply in future whenever they visit you on campus so you'll get if you clear the interview you will get 3.6 lpa package right so that's one way now the other way is again if you score more than 65 percentile or 65 percent you have an option. You, it's not mandatory. You are still anyways going to get an interview, but you have an option of one more round called as advantage round. So this is called as certification round. If you score more than 65 percentage, you have an option to give an advantage round. Now what that advantage round will do is you will get a different, a little more difficult kind of an interview. If you clear that advantage round also, now, based upon your performance in that particular interview, you have three options. If you perform average, you'll get this particular role that is 3.6 LPA. If you perform good, then you'll get 5 LPA role. And if you have great performance, then you'll get 8 LPA role. Right. And let's say if you don't, if you don't even perform well in that interview, but so you'll get rejected and but you can apply in future. So here. Uh, and again, if you don't score more than 65%, so you don't meet the cutoff, you can apply in future if you like, right? So you have an option if you score more than 65%, your one interview is guaranteed. So you'll get 3.6 LPA interview for sure. But let's say if you really want, you can go ahead and give the advantage round. And again, if you don't clear the advantage round, then also you'll still get the 3.6 LPA interview because you've cleared the certification round. So you can pause about it and you'll basically be understanding more. You can pause this to understand flowchart. So registration is starting on 26th and this is the certification round. Now, the whole syllabus of everything that I'm going to mention on this page has already been covered on Prep Insta Prime, right? Uh, uh, the course that we've created and uh, you'll get 100 plus other courses as well. So this certification round, the duration is three hours. Uh, total number of sections are three. The duration is going to be three hours. Now you can switch between sections. So there are three sections. Section one is coding hands-on. So you'll be basically having two coding questions. We'll talk about the level of difficulty and so on and so forth a little later. What kind of things you should practice. Basically two coding questions. Uh, 10 MCQ questions. So you have to choose either Java or Python as your specific language. So before starting the online test, uh, there will be a prompt which will ask you to choose between Java and Python. So you have to code in Java or you have to code in Python. And if you choose, if you choose Java as your coding language, then MCQ will also come off Java. It can't be like, okay, you chose Java for coding, but you want to attempt MCQ for Python. No, it will be either Java, Java, or python python so 10 questions mcq uh, of java or python whichever you choose and then dbms and sql so it should not be slash it should be comma comma sql 
10 questions we are covering this we are covering this we are covering this in our online course now switching between section is allowed so let's say if you are attempting this particular question or, or let's say if you're attempting this particular section you can switch between this section and this section or oh, there's overall timing right uh, question switching is also allowed so let's say if you are in question 7 you can go to question 9 and probably then come back to question 1 you can do that there's no negative marking there's no sectional timing test platform is their own platform in ptq right so moving ahead so this is the syllabus of the coding part this is the certification round that i'm talking about now certification round the coding part is going to be i'll not say very easy but let's say there's no competitive programming in it right so these are the prep and start uh, basically the syllabus as per us would be all of these uh, array strings matrices operations and numbers functions uh, conversion and octal decimal basics of dsa and pattern printing uh, more or less there is a particular page which is amazing for all of these service based companies so let's say prep and start top 100 if you google uh, so you'll find all of these codes here that we highly recommend for all of these service based companies so as you can see and the level of difficulty keeps on increasing as you scroll down so this should be more than enough uh, and in java all of these sections in python all of these section you can pause this and then probably take a screenshot of it also if you really want and then dbms and sql all of these as well right now this is about the certification round now what if if you choose to if you clear the certification round and you're like okay no but i still want a higher package let's go ahead and give the advantage round what's the bad thing right if you don't clear the advantage round you still get an interview for 3.6 lpa and if you clear the advantage round you'll have a chance for a higher 5 LPA or 8 LPA package, right? So in that particular thing, there would be, just give me a second. In that particular, th uh, the, the test duration again is three hours. The number of coding questions would be three. Java, you have to choose again, either Java or Python. Question one of 50 marks, question two, 75, question three, 100 marks. And these are all the things that we think would be the syllabus for it. So again, pointers, arrays in dsa time complexity space complexity asymptotic notation recursion searching sorting stacks views linked list trees binary search so basically whole dsa priority queue keeps hashing and whole of competitive coding backtracking dynamic programming greedy divide conquer graphs cross skill prims dashtra union find detecting cycle in, in, in an mst so this is basically the syllabus for that one and uh, basically you can uh, the link to register you can find in the description of the video if you haven't basically the link looks like on wing span in ptq let's google Malaba. even i don't have it so basically here you'll find you have to log in and then after logging in and creating your id you'll be able to find how to register here we've also created one more video on how to register you can check our youtube channel as well now in terms of the syllabus uh the whole thing as you can see prep and stuff prime so let's go to prep and stuff prime you'll get all of these courses uh uh, that is complete preparation for your uh, in, uh, for your placement preparation, TCS IR remote internship and prep and star certification. These two certifications you'll be getting for each and every course that you complete on prep and star prime, C, C++, Java, Python, AI, ML, cybersecurity, ethical hacking, big data, basic coding, intermediate coding, competitive coding uh, in all languages, by the way, right? C, C++, data structures, data structures for service-based companies, quants, logical, all of these, comp uh, all of these uh, platforms like AMCAP, at cubes uh, basically all of these are basically the ones wherein your online test for different companies happen uh, different company service base different company product base interview preparation projects because projects are really really important cs subjects coding brush up and interview plus uh, so all of these things in terms of the InfiniTQ preparation course again this is the page the link of it is in the description of the video so one of the course as you can see here is if you go to companies that is service-based companies, you will be able to find this NPTQ course. And uh, this is the whole syllabus of whatever we are covering in it. Data structures, competitive coding, competitive coding, you can click here because the again, it's very large. So which is why we needed another page for us to do that. So let's click here and let's go to the competitive coding page. There's demo videos also. You can watch all of these demo videos here if you like and uh, we'll also play you a short trailer at the very end of the course so here you can find all the demo videos of different courses 
so competitive coding the link again all of this in the description of the video and uh, make sure that you share it with your friends may they make sure that you share it with your tpos we are also running a program wherein we are partnering with different colleges so let's say a college wants subscription for whole of their university they can reach out to us and we'll give humongous discount up to 70% discount if the whole college partners so there are different plans uh, of uh, so let's say if you go to this particular page that is purchase so prepare prime is available in different plans so let's say if you click here there's one month three months six months if uh, there's 12 months there's 18 months there's 24 months there's 36 months there's 48 months also so you can get all of these and the prices are also really really competitive so thank you so much one very very last thing make sure that you follow us on all of these social media handles because cisco amazon goldman sachs these are and jp morgan paypal these are all the companies that are going to be hiring next few months these are the companies that start even before you coming in your seventh semester make sure you follow prep Insta 2023 we've already posted some particular companies that were hiring right so google was hiring goldman sachs was hiring uh, BNY Melon was hiring, Hacker Rank was hiring, right? So thank you so much. I'll see you up ahead in the next video.